It's important to make time for things that you love, to acknowledge the beauty in the mundane. Today, I took time to look for dandelions to craft some home remedies. Both the sun and moon were in the sky, which I thought was really auspicious. Going out and gathering early spring flowers is really humbling, and it's a way for me to connect to the earth. It's really a grounding activity for my body and my mind. It's also a timeless act. How many people before me have also found solace in nature? I take time to sift through the flowers and think about what they really mean to me. Their significance. Dandelions are connected with the goddess Hikari, who rules cycles, changes, and crossroads. I think of my own changes throughout life since childhood. To me, dandelions represent the happy innocence of the time. I've chosen to make a rejuvenating spring tonic, so I'm just filling my bottle about halfway with flowers and the rest with vodka. Which you could also use vegetable glycerin or apple cider vinegar, I just find that the vodka keeps longer and is a lot more potent. Quite a few dandelions left over, so I decided to make a nourishing flower bomb. I'm just using plain olive oil here, and then topping the rest off with calendula oil in a double boiler. Making a bomb isn't too difficult because you only need a few things. I'm heating about two tablespoons of wax and adding the plant oil on top. Once the balm sets, I'm topping it with yarrow flowers, which represent protection and healing. I know the video wasn't super in-depth, but I hope I could brighten your day with some flower magic. With that being said, I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.